5.03 a.m. And y'all already know what time it is. Time for another adventures Travel day! My plane is here. Before the plane get overly crowded, I want to give y'all a quick update. Um, I just boarded my flight. I took an early flight to Miami. We are literally trying to outrun Tropical Storm the Co. Um, so, as my, if you didn't watch my previous vlog, my flight was scheduled for 8.15 this evening. The Tropical Storm Nicole is scheduled to hit Miami this evening. So, I switched my flight to 8.15 this morning. So, I'm on an early flight. I'm tired. We got a lot of rush around yesterday to make up for the time I'm missing today. But I'm on my flight. We headed to Miami. We trying to out run, beat Tropical Storm Nicole. This is a direct flight, which I love. So, no layovers. Um, so far, so good. Hopefully, we should get there with smooth sailing. I will keep you guys posted. Next update, we're going to reach Miami. But we're going our way to our first solo cruise. And I'm so excited. Um, been a smooth travel day so far. Everything went real, real smooth. We're about mm, five minutes late boarding, but we're good to go. I'm in the back of the plane, like three rows in the back, which I love. Not you know, I don't like being all the clothes and everybody gets acting crazy. So let's go to myself. I'm about to turn around and I'm going to and go to sleep. I'm the whole road to myself. It does us up to 25 miles an hour, which isn't that bad. Uh, not that we haven't seen uh, hundreds of times, so it's going to be a little bumpy is all. And we're going to have you on the ground a little bit early today. Thanks for being with us. And uh, we'll have you on the ground here in just about 20 minutes. No way, it's a flight to Chicago Midway. One o'clock just got canceled. Whoa. We got some conversation up on American. These are um, leaving. These are departures. They got some cancellation popping up, so I wanted to show cancellations popping up and delays are popping up. That's like for Chicago is canceled, so we need safely. The last five minutes, I'm not gonna lie, was bumpy as hell. <laughs> it was a rough way, and then um, it was more so the wind. And it's crazy because I just finished watching Manifest, the new season, and it kind of freaked me out. I'm like, oh crap, oh crap. So I'm gonna wear the baggage claim, gotta get my bag. Um, it is rainy and the wind, I haven't been outside, but it's windy. Um, a lot of flights are being canceled. I don't know if I mentioned to you all yet, but my original flight, I was on for the night flight, it was canceled. So glad I switched my flight. At least I'm here in Miami. Next boat is to get on the damn ship. But I'm here in Miami. Been grabbing my bag, bumping down to my hotel room, and just chill out and keep the updated what's going on. But it'll get my bag. I'm glad I packed all the extra stuff too. So, I already got food and snacks. I ain't got to Uber eat. I ain't got to do nothing but just get to my hotel. Let's get our bag, y'all. But, whew, Tropical Storm Nicole, you would not stop this cruise. You would not stop it. Well, I don't see the rain. It's right. You hardly can see it that good on the camera, but it's coming down pretty good. I don't know how windy it is. What's going on? I see my bag. My bag. My bag. Y'all can see me okay, so I want to give y'all a little update about what's been going on. So, as you guys come in the hotel now, I did do a complete room tour of the hotel. So, if you're looking for a pre cruise hotel stay in Miami, I want you all to see the room. Um, but you guys will see it over the next um couple of days. So, so far in the Facebook group, um, so many flights have been canceled. I think I mentioned in the airport, you guys heard me. My original night flight was canceled. 
Um, so I'm so grateful that we are, that I keep saying we force of habit, um, that I made it safely to Miami. Um, I'm in the hotel room. The hotel is safe. It's fully stocked. It's so clean, so nice. They have a happy hour at five, which I'll be going down there to check it out. Um, so I'm in the room getting all my devices recharged up. So far, so good. Being a solo cruiser, it's been so, it's so nice just to have my own time. Like I came in the room, like all this space is mine. Yes, it's okay. Um, turn on a little music from my iPad. This is some music and just vibing off that for a minute. I like listening to music. Um, I like TV too, but I like to some music. So this is some music. Um, it's a little Chinese for us. We're like literally right next door. So I'm gonna give you some Chinese food in a minute. Um, I'll do I have my little rice, macaroni and cheese. So I'm gonna get some orange chicken for lunch slash dinner with your whole meal. And it's a microwave to heat it up. So that's good too. So overall, I feel so liberated being on the solo cruise. It's like, this is nice. I already in my mind and visualizing doing a seven day one. Um, I'm already just in my mind thinking what year could be next year? Can I do it the year after? Um, I'm already feeling just like, I actually met some people at the airport that's going on a cruise. Um, it was three days, it was on a girl's trip, but a couple of them being, it was three days, it was three on a girl's trip, they stayed in a room together. There was two other people, there was a couple, but they all was in one group. We chit-chatted, hoping like, is we gonna make it to the cruise? Is the cruise gonna happen? We was talking about that at the airport as we're getting our baggage, so hopefully I'll see them again on the ship. Carnival did, I'm reading from my iPad, give us an update as of 10 a.m. this morning. Um, so they're basically saying that the port is closed to all marine traffic as of now, as of um, 10 a.m. this morning. Um, the ship, the sun rises at sea. Um, for the sun, sunrise coming back on the 10th, there to stay updated. The one that's on the, the night, um, the conquest, which is currently out now, um, they're going to Key West Cosmo. The Mexico remains the same. For us, it says to stay updated, stay alert for the text messages. So we haven't got any text messages as of yet. It's been a new update as of 5 p.m. Um, so they haven't canceled our cruise, anything like that. Um, they're basically just tracking it. So what are my plans if the cruise get canceled? <laughs> um, well, I couldn't leave the hotel. So I would try to just probably stay at the hotel for a couple more days here. Um, buckle down and stay here for a couple more days if the cruise is canceled until I can get a flight out home. So I would try to, to see whether the storm out here because I'm in a safe environment. I feel comfortable here. Um, I wouldn't go to the airport and just sit there. No, I stay here. Um, but I, it is windy out there. It is raining out there. Um, but being at the hotel, I feel completely safe, comfortable, and I'm good here. So no complaints here. So let's go and get some food. Like it's literally next door, like, and it's covered. So I'm gonna go get this food, come back, and I'm gonna show you guys around the pool area during a happy hour. I'm gonna let my phone charge. I just left the Chinese restaurant that's literally like right here. Mother restaurant, it's raining. Not too bad, y'all. Not too bad. I had to walk by to get food, so that's a good thing. So it's not too bad um, so far. It's supposed to get be bad tomorrow so we're gonna buckle down got my chinese food now bar is open tonight from 5 to 11. drinks music happy hours from 5 to 7. i thought it was about 11. they were having some taste of miami there so it's pretty interesting all right that's the other place okay i'm gonna tell some cuban food okay back to my room now went literally right next to that be some um orange chicken it's about this is good enough for me got the orange chicken got a chicken fried rice Came with an egg roll for ten dollars, so pretty fair reasonable what I would pay at home. So things gonna be good. Um, so that's good. It's spicy. It looks good too. So yeah, ten dollars for the, uh, um egg rolls a lunch special, and like I said, it's really seriously connected to right. It was connected like right right next door, so that was pretty convenient. I wasn't out in the rain anything like that. So I keep you guys updated on my progress. I can eat some lunch because I am hungry right now. Um, so I'm going to eat some lunch, and then I'm going to lay across the bed and just chill out because I can do what I want to because I'm on my solo cruise. <laughs> I want to take me a quick little nap, but I'm trying to get y'all in focus, but you can see it's rain is acting crazy. The winds are definitely picked up, if you guys can see, um, through the rain, through the palm trees, the winds are picked up. The palm trees are moving a little bit faster. 
And it was when I got here. Yeah, I can't get a good focus because my window is full of rain, but palm trees are definitely moving a lot more than they did before. But I feel safe in my hotel room. I got some lunch, got some snacks. So I'm just gonna bunker down, take me a quick nap and get ready for happy hour. Yes. So I am back. I took me the most amazing nap ever. <sighs> that Chinese food, I messed up. I laid down across that bed. That damn bed was so comfortable. It's so fucking comfortable. And I took a nice long nap and it felt so good. <laughs> um, just like a little afternoon, little nap. That food knocked me out. So me a nice long nap. So it is now 5.40. Happy hour starts from five to seven. I thought it was five to 11. The bar is open until 11. So I'm gonna go downstairs happy hour, have me a Cosmo or a drink or something. That's what they have um, for happy hour. Have a couple of cocktails. They're supposed to have some live music. So hope to catch some live music. Then I'm gonna come back up here and hop in. Um, and let's laugh for wine down Wednesday in the room because I ain't gonna be next downstairs too drinking too much. I'm kind of glad that everything today happened where it did because just being able to rest today has been amazing. And also, um, we are no longer under a tropical storm watch. So I, I guess Nicole is moving her ass someplace else. And our crew so far, according to John Hill, at as of the last 40 minutes, is still to go for Friday. So the hurricane cruises are gonna make it. We're gonna make it. Let's go to happy hour and listen to some music and whatnot. Took the hair down, pull a lip gloss on, and I think I'll still listen to some music. Let's go get some drinks. Ain't no live music yet. Yeah. Well, I need a free glass of wine. It's okay. I'm gonna get a shot. Not up in the next. That's gonna really get me good in. But this wine is not bad. Not bad. Okay, I'm back in the room. I met some amazing people. We hung out at the bar for like hours. I got some wings at the local bar from next door. Eat them. I had so many cocktails tonight, y'all. So many free cocktails tonight. And I'm a little lit, but I'm back in the room safely. The storm has not really passed us right now. We are safe in this hotel. Um, and yeah, ready for Nicole to pass through us and let's have a good time. So solo cruise day one has been a success. I can't wait to see what tomorrow brings, whether I'm getting out the room or I'm gonna be in the room all day. I don't know, but I'm prepared for both. And yeah, solo cruising, meeting new people, my life, I love it. Thanks so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Or this video may be combined with tomorrow. Who knows what may happen? We'll see. Peace, my loves.